Hello people, welcome back to my Pokemon Black Nuzlocke. This is episode 16. In the previous episode, we made our way up Route 6 here and made it up to Chargestone Cave where we caught a Clink. Uh, yeah, the Clink is not here, it's in the box. But we did, uh, when we went to catch this Clink, we got a peek of the cave and we saw N standing there. So I have no idea if he is going to fight or not. So just in case, I think I'll put Luna out in front because she's our highest level Pokemon. So here we go. I really hope he doesn't fight. All right, hello, N. Cool. Come. Okay. My lord N, we brought the one you wanted. Ooh, okay. Ah, uh, yes. That was the shadow triad just now. Getsis enlisted them in Team Plasma. Apparently, they were the ones who prepared the Galvantu Galvantula nest in the at the cave entrance. Charged Stone Cave. I like this place. Formulas express electricity in its connection to Pokemon. If people did not exist, this would be an ideal place. You have been chosen, you know? Does it surprise you I said that? Uh, yeah, because you're Team Plasma. Why would Team Plasma choose me? Of course. Such news should be a surprise. I told Getsis about you and your friends. After I did, he apparently used a shadow triad to find out about you. Sharon is pursuing the ideal of strength. Poor Bianca has faced the sad truth that not everyone can become stronger. And you are not swayed either way. More of a neutral presence. Which is apparently a good thing. Team Plasma will be waiting for you ahead. Getsis wants to see what kind of a Pokemon trainer you really are. Okay, does that mean that we'll have to fight Getsis? Because I don't want to do that either. Okay, well... Since he's gone... I don't know, I feel like Luna's probably- eh, there are some electric types, so Luna's probably not the best. But there are some bug. Let's see. Okay, I think Neville should be okay. Yeah, I think Neville should be okay in this area. Crackle, crackle, crackle. Wild Pokemon. Oh, a Bulldore. We used to have one of these. Okay, let's just run. Guess what? Who is this? Oh, it's Bianca. Clunch, did you know this? The floating stones move when you touch them. Right, Professor? Oh, it's Professor Juniper. Hi there. How are you, Conch? This place is always charged with lots of electricity that Pokemon like. The electric charges react from one stone to another, and that's why some of the stones are floating. But not all of the stones can be pushed. My father asked me to research Clink, which is a Pokemon that looks like a gear. Yeah, we caught one, so yes we know. Because I'm researching the origins of Pokemon in the era they appeared. He knows how to get what he wants from people, but I was already interested in this anyway, so it's a lot of fun. Oh yeah, Conch, this is for you. 
lucky egg. Giving that lucky egg to a Pokemon to hold increases the amount of experience points received in battle by a lot. Having strong Pokemon will make it easier to fill your Pokédex pages. Okay. Here we go. I pushed out of the way. So are those two just gonna stand there? Oh hey, it's a clink. It's what you wanted, Professor Juniper. So let's keep running from all of these. Oh, there's an item over there. Cool. It's a paralyze heal. Looks like there's a person up here. All right, hello. This cave is full of rocks generating electricity. The electricity is charging me up. All right, got one Pokemon. Scientist Ronald. He has a clink. Okay. So I believe steel is weak to ground. I'm gonna double check that. Yes, they are. So you're gonna dig? Can we dig? I don't think Clink has Levitate, so we should be okay. We'll try it. Okay. Boom, we hit you. Bam, bam. There is an item over here. Uh, okay. A revive, okay. So we can sell those. So there's another guy up there. Okay. There's another item over there. Oh, hello. It's a heal ball. I haven't used a heal ball yet at all. Where's this person? Oh, okay. Guess we see a wild clink first. All right. Oh, you don't. Oh, okay, yeah, he does fight. I will test you to see whether you have what it takes to aim for the Pokemon League. Is this an ace trainer? Those guys are usually tougher. Yeah, ace trainer, but he's only, he, only, he only has one Pokemon. It's an Archon. Okay, well, we just got our own Archon. So... I don't know how... Archon is with ground type moves. It's part rock, which should. Mm. Oh, but it is flying, so it's still immune to ground type moves. So, what about dark type moves? Actually, we are probably weak to, to its flying type. Or apparently not. Okay, so let's see how... Okay, so dark type moves should be normal effectiveness. So let me check my other Pokemon. Uh, do you have anyone that's good against... I guess Luna. Okay, we'll try Luna.
Hello there. Okay. A little bubble beam. He's quick guard. What does that do? Oh. Oh, well, it didn't protect you very much. Alright. I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Okay, now uh, just move around you here. There's a wild Pokemon, a Pharaoh Seed. Interesting, but we are still gonna run. Uh, maybe we should fight something, but I think we're gonna run from this for now. Yeah, we should fight something because Neville's almost level 33. down what oh it's you two hi there did you find something not that i know of i was just walking around the cave i think we're just about done collecting data this cave has been around since the distant past but data to prove that clink existed more than a hundred years ago can't be found so that must mean Clink suddenly appeared a hundred years ago. Where Pokemon came from and where they are going. If we can learn that, I believe we can get along even better. Know what, Conch? Pokemon are mysterious. I wonder why these amazing little guys stay by our sides. Oh, now you guys just stand there. Okay. Oh. Okay, let's stay away from the dust cloud. So I don't know if I'm supposed to go up or down. I'm gonna try going down. All right, we'll run. There's a bridge. Oh, hello. Come. Okay. There are stairs going down ahead. Team Plasma is waiting for you there. Okay, so I guess I was supposed to go down. That's cool. A Hyper Potion. I don't think we took any damage in those fights. Uh, we only lost maybe some uh, PP, but we should be okay. Actually, let's fight this Clink. Let's see if we can get Neville leveled up before Team Plasma. Okay, dig, 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 dig. Use charge. It's okay. Boom. All right. Uh, come on. Okay. Want it to be a clink? Yes. Dig again. And boom. All right. That should be enough. Yeah, Neville is now level 33. So it actually looked like um, Luna was almost going to level up. Yeah, she only needs seven more experience points, so yes. Let's check everyone else. Now oh, she's still a while away. It's a while away. A while away. Is that everyone? Yeah, so let's just level up Luna. Because she's just so close to level 37. Okay, it's a clink.
We're gonna bubble beam. Oh, we're so close to killing it, but not quite. Charge beam! Oh, we have four times weakness. I just realized. But Luna's fine. Okay, let's aerial ace. Make sure we don't miss. And bam. Luna's level 37. Okay, let's put you back there. Okay, I'm gonna actually go to the heal my Pokemon first, and then I will be right back. Okay, I am back, and so I'm gonna leave Neville in the front. Um, I kind of remember that Team Plasma does fight at this point, but I don't know what Pokemon they have. So hopefully we are strong enough to take them on. So yeah, let's see how it goes. Did they mean these stairs? Oh, hello person. Okay, I guess we're finding you first. I love this place! The electricity charges up my inspiration! Okay, I wasn't expecting any more trainers before Team Plasma, but okay. So she also has a clink. Okay, we're gonna dig. X special, okay. The scientist keeps using those like, the status items. But it doesn't even matter because we kill you in one hit. And haha. -ha. Okay, I think we're okay to just keep on going. So, did they mean these stairs? I don't see any Team Plasma. I see two dudes. I'm just walking around. Here's a... This guy looks like a nurse. Maybe he'll heal my Pokemon. If you like, I will make your Pokemon healthy. However, let me challenge you to a battle first. Okay, cool. No, but he's a doctor because he's a dude. A Swadloon. Okay. This Neville is not gonna fight this. Uh, I guess Luna is the best Pokemon to take on the Swadloon. Here we go. String shot. Ooh, okay. Lower our speed, but we should be fine. We're gonna use fly. Well, let's just do an aerial ace. See how much damage that does. Oh, it was enough. So cool. Ha. Now, as I promised, I will make your Pokemon healthy. Awesome. To make people healthy, doctors go where they are needed. So do you always heal? Yeah, okay. Cool. I'm just double checking that it wasn't a one-time thing with this healing. Oh, there's Team Plasma. Hello, do I have to fight all of you? Look, an item. Timer ball. Okay. Okay, I guess I will have to fight each grunt. But this is good because it looks like I 
have time to heal in between. And there's a doctor conveniently stationed right there. Okay, so let's go. You, you came here because somebody manipulated you. If you can win against me, I will tell you the secret. All right, I would like to know the secret. Three Pokemon, okay. Sandile. Well, we have a big version of that. It's called a Croc Croc. Okay, I don't think this battle will go anywhere. Because we're all the same type. Let me see, this ground on ground. Okay, ground on ground doesn't have any special type effectiveness. Let's just try a dig. And boom. Oh, cool. One hit KO. A scraggy. Oh, the fighting types, the fighting types. So it's fighting and dark. Uh, I was thinking maybe Sybil could go fight it, but uh, let me check. I don't think Sybil likes dark types. So that's a problem. Um, hmm. I guess we will see. Send in Luna. Because she's the only Pokemon we have besides Sybil that can take fighting moves. So here goes Luna. Headbutt, okay. And we will fly. Luna flew up high. Haha, you can't confuse us. And bam, super effective. A watchdog. Guess I'll just fly again. I don't think we have. Oh, well, I guess Sybil maybe could have tried. Tried fighting this watchdog. That's okay. Can't believe you lost. I can. All right, back to this nurse doctor. Okay, so now to fight this next person. Oh, I forgot to ask the other guy about the secret. If I win against you, release your Pokemon. I have to remember to ask the other guy for the secret. He only has- you only have one Pokemon. I have six. Oh, but you have a Scraggy. Okay. Alright, we'll send out Luna. I feel like this cave has been just Neville and Luna fighting. Okay, that is nothing to us. Let's just do an aerial ace, see how that goes. Bam, just aerial ace could do it. Haha. -ha. So I have to ask you about the secret. Getsus of the Seven Sages supports our king and Getsis has three subordinates. They are the Shadow Triad. Triad. Okay. Let's go fight this guy. Pokemon living in this charged stone cave are so beautiful because they are free from people. Yeah, well, 
they're not completely free from people if you people are standing right here in the cave. Trubbish. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. I think poison is weak to ground, it looks like. It is. Perfect. We will dig. And boom. Yeah, bam, you are dead. Lipard. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Okay. So dark types are weak to fighting and bug and we have neither of those. Let's see. They're immune to psychic. Hmm. 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 I guess it looks like ground has is neutral when it comes to type advantage or disadvantage, so we will just continue using dig. Oh, fake out, okay. Okay, we are six levels above this life hard, so I think we'll be fine. And bam. Boom, one hit KO. Okay. 1,000 experience points. Okay, Neville's level 34. Awesome. Was not expecting that, but awesome. Okay, I just realized, uh... Oh, no, Neville has an item, okay. I was thinking Luna has the amulet coin, so... Maybe if we gave it to Neville, we can get a bit more money. But Neville's already holding, uh, I think it was soft sand, so... He doesn't have any more space for items. Which is fine. A wild Pokemon right in front of this plasma grunt. A Joltik! Oh look, it's so cute and fuzzy. And a bug. I don't really like bugs. Okay. But yeah, only in Pokemon will do bugs look cute. You... You are the trainer that my lord N is worried about! I really don't get why you guys are all fighting me if... N and Getsis wanted to see me. Unless you guys are challenging me, I guess. Yeah, they... N did say that Getsis wants to see what kind of a trainer I am, so I guess these are just tests. But it just seems like... Um, it's like... Uh, having to fight these Plasma Grunts first gives me more experience and therefore I can level up right before fighting... Uh, is it Getsis, I think? And that seems a bit... Uh, backwards. Why would you give your challenger an opportunity to level up right before fighting them? Okay, boom. And bam, Trubbish is dead. She has more? Okay, we'll dig again. This Trubbish is dead. Alright. Okay, now there's you. Oh, there's so many of them. As a proud member of Team Plasma, I will gladly battle with you. Okay, and you have 
two Pokemon. First is a Watchdog. I'm gonna just keep digging. Here we go, digging. Super Fang, but you miss. Okay. And it kills the Watchdog. Cool. Oh, Sandile. Okay, we learned from the previous Sandile that we can dig against you. And we use dig. Neville's almost level 35. That's awesome. Okay, I'm gonna go talk to that uh, doctor. Heal up my Pokemon. But there are wild Pokemon. Okay, we're gonna run from you. Okay. Hello. All right, back up. Keep walking, keep walking. Oh, wild Pokemon. Okay. All right, let's run. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, an Everstone. Okay. I don't think I'm going to use it. Okay, I was also not expecting to get an item. I thought it was going to be a wild Pokemon. Hello there. Oh, there are more stairs I have to go down. The hope of Team Plasma. Well, it has nothing to do with you. Okay. I think it does have something to do with me. Because if I'm still around, you guys have no hope at all. Alright, here's a lie part. We will continue digging. Here we go. Dig. Alright. And bam. And you're dead. Oh, Neville is level 35! Okay, cool. Alrighty. Let's go fight this person. Okay, there are some stairs over here that go up. Huh. Okay, trainer. You use Pokemon. Show me your strength. Alright, I will. I guess Neville will. Alright. We can handle Sandile. We'll dig. Right, boom. And you're dead. As a watchdog. That's fine. We will still dig. Confuse, right? Okay, good. Yeah, you can't confuse us. And now you're dead too. Okay. So, am I supposed to go up or down? Uh, anyone tell me? We know our king will lead us. He will free the Pokemon. You, release your Pokemon and stop being a trainer. 
Okay, but which direction am I supposed to go in? I'm gonna go to the doctor first. And then I guess we'll figure out what direction I'm supposed to go in. I guess I'll try going down first. Seems to only make sense that the bad guys are further underground. Okay, we run. Hello? Okay, cool. We are now all healed up. And there's a wild Pokemon. Okay, we will run. And another wild Pokemon. Okay, we'll also run. gonna try going down okay and there's nothing here I think that's an ace trainer hello I'm really serious about training I even visit this electrified cave to train myself and my Pokemon all right Two Pokemon. First is a Drillbur. Well, we have a ground type too. It's a Neville. Oh, her Pokemon is level 30. Okay, that's the highest level of the Pokemon we've seen in this cave. So we're gonna dig. Okay. Alright, let's see how Dig does against Drillbur. So this thick animation takes so long. Oh well. There's we want hit Kato the Strilber. Zebstrika. Mm. Okay, that's oh it's good. Okay, yeah. Uh, we are good against electric types. Oh, they're faster than us. That's okay, we can take a pursuit. I'll try pursuit again, but we will dig. And bam. Oh, Neville's almost level 36. What? Have you seen Team Plasma around? Oh. Okay, run away from all the wild Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, okay, run. Okay, another wild Pokemon. You know, maybe we'll fight it because we're so close to level 36. Let's dig. You, you tried Thundershock, but we are ground type. It wouldn't have worked anyways, even if you didn't miss. And we're level 36. I'm scary face. Mmm. I think I'm okay with Scary Face. Let me double check. Scary Face just makes it so the opposing Pokemon can't switch out, right? Oh no, nope, that's, I take that back. I was wrong. That was mean look. This reduces the speed stat. Mm, I think it's okay. I don't think we need it. Okay, give up on Scary Face. Cool. 
so I have no idea where our team Plasma is now. Ooh, the little Tynamo. Okay, but we're still running from you. There's an Ace Trainer down there, but no Team Plasma. Hey, an item. Powder. Okay, I don't know what that is. Okay, there is a trainer here. But I don't see Team Plasma, so I'm gonna go back up the stairs and try the other direction. Uh, but I think I'll visit the doctor first, because you can never heal too many times. I have to get away from this Joltik first. There's... Hello, people that I just beat. Alright. Okay, all these abilities take so much time. Okay, and we got away safely. Here's the doctor. Alright, so right now I was just thinking um, Neville and Luna are both very high level compared to everyone else, especially Jenny and Sybil, who have uh, neither of them have reached level 30 yet. So I was just thinking maybe I should put one of them out in front in the upcoming battles. But I also don't want to risk them dying in case they can't handle it. So I think we will keep Neville out in front and then maybe we'll just grind later to raise the level of these guys. So yeah. All right, continuing. Oh, okay. So Drillbur. Okay, we don't really care because we're gonna run. Okay, up, uh, okay. Alright, we're gonna just run from you also. that rock away and off that rock away so I guess we go up and there's nothing here either there's an ace trainer wait so where am I supposed to go there's a scientist I guess we'll fight you I want to solve all the mysteries in the world for that purpose i will keep fighting okay interesting placement of exclamation marks we've got one pokemon it's a clink okay we will dig dire hit mm. Well, it shouldn't matter because we're gonna just dig and kill you. Yep, killed. Okay. So have to keep finding Team Plasma. 
It's like a backpacker person. I guess we'll try fighting you. I am a hiker exploring caves. I will teach you the harshness of life and the difficulty of Pokemon battles. Alright. Let's see you do that. Two Pokemon. His name is Hardy. Interesting. He's got a Bulldore. Which means Bulldore will probably have Sturdy. So instead of digging right away, let's give it a little mud slap. That actually almost did half damage. Oh, you try mud slap too. Cool. We will mud slap you right back. It's like a mud slap battle. Will it kill you? Nope. Iron defense, okay. Way to break the mud slap fight. I oh, will just mud slap again. And you're dead. Okay. Girder. Mm -mm. The fighting Pokemon. See, we don't like that. So we need Luna. Rock throw! Oh gosh. Luna? Okay. We're okay. Okay, guess we will fly to ensure we kill it in one hit. Okay. And boom. Oh, okay. Alright. And the wild Pokemon. Alright, but actually, where is- oh, I'm back here. Oh, hello. Okay, but where is Team Plasma? Let's just go back. Uh, there was a trainer here. Yes, hello. Take this! The winning strategy I've developed! <laughs> okay. Right, you've got two Pokemon. His name's Corky. Okay. Whimsicott? I. Uh, People with their grass types in a cave. Okay, uh, this we will switch to Luna. Mega Drain. Ooh, okay. I'm gonna fly. Oh, con spore. What is that lower speed? Okay. Well, we were already slower than you, so I guess it doesn't make much of a difference. And then we fly on your head. All right. Tortuga. Ooh, okay. Okay. Mm. What are your weaknesses? Okay, it's a water and ground type. So... Uh -huh, looks like you're weak to grass. Yeah, you have four times weakness to grass, but we don't have any grass moves. To fighting. You may be weak to ground, actually. But Neville is weak to water. Mm. Okay, this is a tough one. 
Uh, how are you with flying type moves? Okay. Should we try sending Ginny out? Because Ginny does have jump kick. And it's a grass type, so it should be fine with dealing with both rock and the water moves. Uh, I guess we will try it. Okay, Jenny, here we go. You're one level lower than this Tortuga. Ancient power. Oh boy. Oh boy, Jenny, 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 Jenny. Okay. Now, how much damage? Uh, 24. Okay. I think we should be okay. So jump kick. Oh, that's it. Okay. So looks like all he's using is ancient power. Ugh. Because we'll try sending Neville in. As long as he doesn't have any water moves, we'll be okay. Get intimidate you. Okay, ancient power. We should be okay with that. Yeah, it's not very effective. Oh wow, all your stats rose. What the? Okay, we're gonna dig. All right, so now even if you try to use a water type attack, it should miss. Hot, just like that. Okay. And now we dig. How does that do? And it kills you! Cool. Ooh, okay. Okay, this looks like an egg. Oh, there's an item. A magnet? Okay. Alright, let's go back downstairs. Oh, I didn't explore this. Oh, it's N. Okay. Yeah, hi. So I guess I found where I'm supposed to go. But let's uh, see the doctor first. Okay, good thing I didn't get too close to N or else that might have been bad. Without healing first. Oh man, okay. But wasn't I supposed to find Getz's first? I thought they said Getz's was, was here. Oh, the wild Pokemon. Here we run. All right. Oh, oh, the wild Pokemon. I don't like you guys. <laughs> I only took like two steps and there's another wild Pokemon. And again. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Alrighty. There's so many wild Pokemon. Another one! There's another one! I just want to make my way back over to N. Right, 
push that. Okay, up the stairs. And he was right here. Oh, okay. I guess we encounter a wild Pokemon right in front of him. Straight in his line of sight. Okay. And okay. Hello, N. Many different values mixed together, and the world becomes gray. That is unforgivable. I will separate Pokemon and people, and black and white will be clearly distinct. Haha, black and white! This is where this, the generation got their names from. Only then will Pokemon become perfect beings. Yes, that is my dream. That is the dream I must fulfill. Conch, do you have a dream of your own? Uh, sure, why not? You have a dream. That's wonderful. I'll learn just what kind of dream you have. In battle. Here we go. Fighting N. It's kind of scary. All right, he has four Pokemon. Okay, first is Bulldore. Okay. He can take, oh, it's level 28, okay. I thought his Pokemon were gonna be all level 30 or higher. But it's level 28. That is cool. We will mud slap you. Okay, use Iron Defense. That's okay. Do you believe that Pokemon battles help us understand one another? What, he just said he was gonna separate people from Pokemon, yet he has his own Pokemon that he's fighting with right now? That seems hypocritical. All right, and your first Pokemon is dead. Okay, got three more to go. Joltik. Joltik. Okay, so it's a bug. Mm. So apparently ground types are not good against bug. But dark moves, okay. Maybe we'll try crunch. So I want to keep Neville in because the Joltik could have some electric attacks, which Neville is immune to. Um, yeah. Okay, so we'll just crunch. Oh, you're so close to killing it. Gastro acid. Their ability was suppressed, okay. Uh, we'll just do some assurance. And you're dead. Okay, a pharaoh seed. So I think this is a grass type? In which case we would be bad against it. But we do have dig. It's still level 28. And you gotta level up your Pokemon more. There are ace trainers in this cave that have Pokemon level 30. And you're here at tw 28. What? Okay, so we do have dig. And I think we would be faster, so as long as we can get underground uh, before it attacks, we should be okay. And we do get underground before the Pharaoh Seed attacks. Oh, and it just used Iron Defense, okay. Okay, I was worried it was gonna come up with a Grass attack. Ooh, okay. Okay, it did less than half the damage. And it has iron barbs. So I'm gonna just go again. Metal claw. Ooh, so it has metal claw. Iron 
parts. He's using metal claw. How do we deal with that? Okay. We're fine with it. Uh, now, how is dark type against this? It's a steel Pokemon. Looks like it's nothing in particular. Okay, maybe we'll try Crunch. And we'll still get Iron Barbed, but hopefully it'll kill it. And nope, it did not. It did not kill it. Okay, okay. Oh, yeah. We should have just dug again. All right. Uh, I think we'll have Luna come in. Metal Claw. Oh, they still attack in that turn? Okay. Should we try Aerial Ace? It looks like he doesn't have much HP left. So... Okay, and we get iron bars, that's fine. And level grew to level 37. Okay, his last Pokemon's a clink! Oh, I will show you that my love for my friends permeates every cell of my body. Behold. Okay, well if Neville's HP wasn't in the red right now, I would definitely switch to him. Uh, as it is, Luna is out right now, dealing with the steel type. I think yeah, flying is... it doesn't do that much damage. So Clink is good against flying types. But what about... okay, so flying moves are weak against steel, but what about steel on flying? So those don't have any special effects, it looks like. How's water on steel? Okay, that's nothing. Maybe I'll do a bubble beam. This guy might have electric type attacks though. That's a little scary. You know what? I'm going to... I guess I'll heal Neville on this turn. I think Luna can take whatever attack Clink does. Charge Beam? Okay. We'll be okay. We, we handled it before. Okay. Okay. Cool. Alright, so now we can bring Neville back out. Okay, you try Charge Beam again. It doesn't affect us. Okay, we're gonna dig, dig a dig, dig a dig, gear grind, okay, and boom, that's the last of N's Pokemon. My friend's getting hurt, that's what a Pokemon battle is. <laughs> Why? Is it impossible for me to win while feeling bad about being a trainer? As if I could pursue my ideals with something as meaningless as a battle. As if that could make me worthy to become friends with a legendary Pokemon. Conch! Just a little further to Miss Stralton City! Bianca, you have good ears. I can't believe you heard Conch's voice from that far away. Conch, who is this trainer? Professor Juniper, what are you thinking? You appear to have no qualms about the relationship between people and Pokemon and people. You put Pokemon into categories using arbitrary rules and think you can't understand them like that. 
The very idea of a Pokédex revolts me. What do you have to say for yourself? Oh my, looks like you're not my biggest fan. Your opinion is understandable. It happens to be different from mine, which is equally understandable. How about if all people get to decide for themselves how they relate to Pokemon? You're saying I should just allow people to think of whatever they want and treat Pokemon however they want, no matter whether the Pokemon suffer? I refuse to tolerate the existence of a world like that. Sheesh, okay. Well, I didn't expect him to change his mind right away. But I hope he'll spend a little time trying to understand how others feel. Now then, I think I'll go collect a little more data. For Pokemon and people to get along better, we need to take steps to learn more about them. Um, Conch. I'm gonna go with Professor Juniper now, cause I'm her bodyguard! <laughs> Alright, Bianca. Okay. Here's the exit. Woo! Yeah, we made it to Miss Dralton City. It's the Pokemon Center. Okay, we're done healing. All right, so I said earlier that I should grind and at the very least grind Sybil and Ginny. So I'm gonna go do that right now. I'll try to get them both to level 30. And yeah, I'll see you when I'm done. Okay, so uh, I am not done grinding yet. I am nowhere near done, but I just realized there are still a few trainers I didn't fight in this cave, like these two guys right there. So maybe I could fight them as part of grinding, as part of training Sybil. So I have, so it looks like it'll be a double battle. So I have Sybil and Neville up here and then I could probably switch Stibble to Luna uh, after we start. So yeah, here we go. Or maybe they don't fight. Hi, we're the Nugget Brothers. I am the big brother. And I am the little brother of the Nugget Brothers. Glad you show up. I want to give you this. Very oh, cool, we got a Nugget. All right, we don't fight, but we have a Nugget. I want to give you this too. Another nugget, okay. Alright then, uh, so that's cool. Maybe there are more trainers somewhere else. Okay, so we've been running from Pharaoh Seed because not quite sure how to deal with them. Alright, I don't see any trainers. Okay, uh, um, let's fight this Joltik. Switch to Neville. Slash, okay. And we will dig. And boom. Alright, 
let's keep going. Let's go up those stairs. If there are still no trainers, I'll just continue with uh, normal grinding. I have no idea where I am. Okay, looks like there is absolutely nothing right here. I guess I'll go back to grinding and if I do encounter a trainer, I will uh, show that to you guys. Okay, I don't believe we fought this trainer before, so let's go for it. Even at an even at an electrified electrified place like this, if somebody challenges me, I will take that challenge. That is an ace trainer. All right, a three Pokemon. Oh boy. Oh, okay. So you start with a ghost type. I believe they're weak to dark. Uh, how's... Okay, yes. So let's use Minerva for this. What does that do? Okay. Interesting. Okay, Minerva. You can do it. Don't be confused. Don't be. No, Minerva. Okay. Now don't be confused. Don't be confused. No! Okay, well, Minerva did nothing in this fight. Guess we'll try Neville, because Neville also has dark type moves. Embargo, okay. So let's crunch. Okay. A ducklet. Okay, how do we deal with ducklet? Um. Hmm. Maybe we'll have our own evolved ducklet fight against this. Okay, Luna. Okay. What does Feather Dance do? Okay, lowers attack. Hmm. So we're gonna just fly. So now you'll miss your next attack. Or not. Okay, and then we land on you. Okay. All right, let's try Aerial Ace. And bam. Oh, okay. How do I deal with you? I guess we'll try flying be fine as long as it doesn't hit a grass type attack okay 
Okay, raise its special attack and special defense and its speed. Oh, okay. Oh, so now it's faster. Okay, well, how's your defense? Bam, we just landed on you. Oh, gosh. Mm hmm. Hmm. Let's see. I don't know. Let's try Aerial Ace. Let's hope Luna can take whatever this Lilligant throws at it. Heater Dance. Oh, and now we're confused again. Luna, you can do it. No, Luna! Okay, come on. Mega Drain. Oh no. And it brought back all of its HP. Luna, you have to hit this. Luna, why? Okay. I mean, Neville's also weak to grass. Maybe we could just write out the confusion. So I'll heal Luna. So we've been confused two turns. I don't know if this turn counts because Luna didn't try to attack or anything. Okay, so Mega Drain does a 31. Okay, so if he does it again, we should be fine. Yeah, we are already confused. Come on, Luna. Yes, finally. Oh, and you don't kill it. Mm, okay, we'll try it again. Yes. Yes, finally. I'm not confused. Sheesh, Luna. And Minerva, like what the with all your confusions you hit yourself like most of the time. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the doctor and continue grinding, so yeah.
Okay, so we finally got Ginny here and Sybil to level 30. Here's a take a look at Sybil. Uh, nothing really changed. Uh, she wanted to learn Curse, but I I don't like it because uh, for Curse you have to uh, deal some damage on yourself and I don't want that so I decided to pass on Curse. And then here is Ginny. I think she didn't learn any new attacks either. But yeah, now everyone is at least level 30. So that's cool. I think this is where I will end this episode today. Uh, so this episode we went through Charged Stone Cave, uh, battled some Team Plasma Grunts and N. Uh, next episode, I actually want to grind more because both Ginny and Sybil evolve at level 34 and we're starting to get there and I also think it'd be good to maybe get them up up to around level 34, 35, get everyone up there. So next episode we'll probably start with more, more grinding and then we'll continue with the story. So that's it. I'll see you next time.